Hey guys, just laying here meditating, and I was just thinking I should share a couple things with y'all. So, I was thinking back on my spiritual journey and how it all started. I was like, probably like 19, I wanted to be a fashion designer. See my, my design back there, I'm working on it. Um, I wanted to be a fashion designer of, of all kinds, you know, interior, clothes, wet and gowns, you know, just everywhere, everything. A artist of all kinds, a healer of all kinds. I just basically wanted to live my life in a way where I was free to do all the things I love to do because all the things that I love to do is for the betterment of everyone involved, like everybody in the world. Like if you really get to know me, then you would know that. And um, at 19, I ended up in a couple situations well first it was my first son's dad he tried to box me in when I did not stay in that box he tried to shoot me so I was on the run for a long time trying to just find myself my spiritual journey started taking off crazy I had to really start listening to my higher self my intuition so that I could be safe keep my son safe and still keep the faith that I'm still going to be able to do what I need to do Fast forward to now, my son is 12, and it's been a great journey. Um, I started this YouTube channel after I saw Magical Lady Duchess, and I ordered my candles from her. I had an Isis candle, and I bought the first one that I bought was a money manifesting candle. I think it was like a seven day candle. It smelled so good. I got to go back and get some more of those. Uh, because uh, if you look back at the date, the first, first, first video I did, y'all, go check that video out. Magical Lady Duchess is dope as fuck. She basically enlightened me on my spiritual strength and on manifesting. So I started working on that. Now I'm like, <sighs> guru, what? Yes. High priestess, yes. Like, I'm all that. I'm all that. You know, so I'm so thankful for Magical Lady Duchess. She helped me really open up to my spiritual journey. Nothing was confused anymore. People ask me, did those candles work? Yes, they do. I've actually gotten out of being homeless from after I used those cam um, candles and started, you know, she used to say all the time, you got to do the work. So I was like, persistent, doing the work, doing the work, meditating, praying, inviting my ancestors. And now it's just like, whew, even she commented and was like, yo, so much energy over there. And, you know, she was very proud of me and I'm so thankful for her. Um, so I wanted to tell you guys that it's very important for you to find your higher self. Go find your ancestors. Reach out and treat them nice. Let me show you guys. I know I'm not really dressed, dressed, but I'm gonna show you my altar right now. I got some um some stuff over here for my grandma, my grandma Lucy, and my auntie D. So Grandma Lucy liked the pears. She likes coffee. She likes salsa water. And this one is these cheese doodles for Auntie D. And this strawberry milk. Auntie D loves those. Some tobacco here I burnt for um, Grandma and Auntie D. <laughs> um, you know, just taking care of them, showing them. Oh, this is where I burn my sage at. My soulmate bought me this uh, Douce bottle for my birthday. So I used that and um, made me a honey money jar. And I also added my um, my DNA in there. A special kind of DNA, you know. That Lady Tom DNA. <laughs> Activated, you know. So anyway, that's the things that I had, you know, started. I uh, graduated like a lot, you know. When I first started off, if y'all go look at the first video, I didn't know nothing. But I was excited. Yes, excited for my journey, y'all. And I'm just so thankful that God, my guardian angels, even you guys, like I started off with no subscribers. <sighs> the feedback at first was like slow, you know, people wasn't really commenting, people wasn't really watching, but it was okay to me because I really wasn't doing it for that. I wanted to keep track of my spiritual journey. And now it's like, 
I'm, I'm like everywhere at the same time as far as watching over my boys while they not with me. I'm there with them. I'm like doing a million things at one time. Like your, your spirit could go and do all of these things to make sure that everything is good. Everything is lined up and all your spirit guides, all your ancestors, even your spiritual soul family, they all come into contact when you start working on yourself. Um, and then we all come together and work together. I want to say thank you all for the, the great feedback. Um, I want to say thank you to my 91 subscribers. I love y'all. Y'all um, have basically given me like uh, very good, like good feelings. I've, I've got good feelings from you guys. I feel the energy coming off of you guys and you do care. You do uh, see what I'm saying. You do relate. And that's what's important to me. I'm helping you guys in many ways. You're helping me in many ways. And I'm just thankful for that. So I just wanted to make a video stating those facts. Love you. See you next time.